Welcome to this whiteboard process template. This template has a step-by-step -step structure, making it perfect for delivering instructions or a guide to your audience. Simply replace the images and text in the sections for each step to suit your own content, and replace this voiceover with one of your own to personally guide your viewers through the process. This process template is laid out in a sequential structure using an image for a backdrop and is themed around writing. The first step to writing a great piece is to plan. You'll need a simple topic or premise to begin with, something to kick off your ideas. Perform some background research to make sure that you understand your topic or premise fully before beginning work on your structure. This is when you decide what the beginning, middle and end of your piece will consist of and everything that happens in between. Bullet points are useful at this stage as you can reorganize each section in a way that makes sense to you. Make sure each section of your piece has a clear point in meaning as well. Once you've come up with a structure you're happy with, it's time to begin your first draft. Don't feel too compelled to write in order. You may have more ideas for specific sections of your piece, so try to get those on paper first before bridging the gaps later. Follow your outline as you write, making sure that the content fills the purpose you gave it earlier. Set yourself a deadline and possibly even daily targets for your writing, so that you don't get sidetracked by refining your work. Your current objective is to complete an early draft, rather than something that is ready for publishing. The best thing to do before you begin redrafting is to take a brief break, so that when you look through it again, you're looking with a fresh pair of eyes. Getting feedback from peers is a great idea for the same reason, but make sure their feedback is honest. As you redraft, remember to look for the most common writing problems, flawed arguments, illogical presentation, sections that need more information or explanation, and irrelevant portions. As you find issues with your work, make a note of them and track your changes to prevent yourself from redundantly revisiting the same areas. Similarly, keeping backups of your work will allow you to restore anything you prefer in retrospect. When you finish revising a final draft that you're happy with, you can begin to prepare it for release, whether you're submitting it to an examiner, an associate, or a publisher. Once more, it's a good idea to distance yourself from your work for a short while so that you can revisit it anew and pick up any final problems. External feedback is especially important at this stage, so try to gather as many opinions on your work as possible. Proofreading is also essential at this stage to make sure your piece is as presentable and accessible as possible. Hey presto! A sequential process diagram in whiteboard style framed by a background image. This is a great process to start with, but perhaps you want to teach your audience about a different process. Simply change and rearrange the images in the diagram, edit the text elements, and replace our voiceover with your own unique narration, and your viewers will be following along in no time. 